Hey what's up guys, Tactorials here and today I'm going to teach you how you can choose the right RAM. Let's go! The first thing you need to understand is that RAM is determined, the type of RAM that's compatible with your computer is determined by three factors. The speed of the RAM, the capacity of the RAM, and the type of RAM. We want to keep these three things the same so that we can buy compatible RAM sticks with your computer. So to check what type of RAM your computer currently uses, you want to go into uh, CPU-Z and you want to download this software. This software tells you all the specifications of your computer, from your motherboard to your RAM to your CPU and it's quite good to check what your computer is. Anyways, once you download it, you want to open it right now and you want to go into the memory section. As you can see, the first thing you want to check is the type right here, the type. Mine is DDR2 RAM. There are four different types of RAM that you need to know. DDR1, I mean DDR, DDR2, DDR3, DDR4. And the higher the number, the better the RAM type. So in my case, I have quite an old PC, so it can only support DDR2 RAM. So when I buy RAM sticks, I always have to make sure that I'm buying DDR2 RAM. So that's the first thing you want to check. The second thing is you want to check is the speed the speed of the RAM stick. So in this case, my bandwidth is PC26400. So you remember that number. Remember that number because this that means that um, this is the kind of uh, RAM your computer supports. 6400 means that it can um, transfer data speeds at 6400 megabytes per second, megabits, right? Anyways, the, set, the third thing we want to check is the RAM stick size. So my total RAM is actually 4 gigabytes over here. But you don't want to look at that, you want to look at each individual RAM size. For example, um, I have two slots, I have two um, RAM sticks right now, and each of them hold 2 gigabytes, so it's a total of 4 gigabytes. But the thing is, you want to, since one stick in your computer holds 2 gigabytes, you want to buy uh, more sticks that also hold 2 gigabytes. You don't want to buy like uh, sticks that hold 4, you want all the size. Um, all the capacity of your RAM sticks to be the same to uh, maintain maximum um, compatibility right so let me give an example if you have one stick of 4 gigabytes of RAM one stick only then you can buy other sticks that also uh, have a capacity of 4 gigabytes of RAM to maintain compatibility then what you want to do is you want, after you know all the stats of your computer it's quite easy you want to go into a place let's just say Amazon because um, that's the place you can buy RAM from and you want to go to Amazon or any other place it doesn't matter and you want to type in um, DDR2 and then you want to type in PC26400 so it's the type of RAM with the with the uh, bandwidth with the speed so you can tell there's a lot of DDR2 RAM over here with PC26400 and one more thing I forgot to tell you is that you must check the size of the RAM as well the size of RAM matters a lot because if you buy the wrong size, it will not fit, right? So for normal computers, for desktop computers like the one I have, um, they will always use 240 pin desktop RAM because that's the full size RAM. But if you have a laptop, you might want to check with the um, manufacturer's website or ask online and search online what type of RAM. Usually they use SD RAM, but it might not be the same for your computer. So yeah, right here, this SD RAM is usually for laptops. but I'm not. I'm not. Um, I'm not gonna confirm that for you. You should go check your website. Anyways, for desktop, you wanna search for 240, 240 pin, and you wanna make sure that the RAM you're buying ha has the same size as the RAM that you have in your computer right now. So two gigabytes. That's right. Uh, DDR2 is correct as well. PC2640 is correct, and the size is correct. So this is the type of RAM that will be compatible with my computer. Your mileage may vary. You will have a different computer. You will have a different size you will have a different speed you will have different capacity it's like not all computers are the same anyways if you manage to find the right ram for your pc that's good but for those that are still quite confused with what i'm saying there's a website that allows you to choose um the, that allows you that shows you the compatible ram with your pre-built pc note that these do not apply to custom built pcs because these uh have you have to choose between companies and if you are building a custom built PC, it's not by company. So in this case, mine is a pre-built PC. So I have a Dell, right? And I have a I have an Optiplex 960, like I said just now. So you just select the one correct for you, uh, right here, and you wanna find the upgrade. And after it finds the upgrade, it will show you a bunch of different type of RAM. 
can see a lot of RAM right here. See, all these RAM are compatible with your PC. Now, this is a lot easier than just now. However, if you have a preview PC, you cannot do this. But I still encourage you guys to buy the same capacity of RAM even though um, your computer supports other capacities because um, different capacities might not work efficiently with each other. It will cause problems that we might not expect. And for the speed, you also want, might want to choose the same one to maintain maximum compatibility. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you are confused, have any questions, comment down below I'll, and I'll explain it to you. Anyways, um, subscribe, subscribe for more tutorials like this and I'll see you next time. Bye! I'm in love with the cocoa.